Well, a 26-year-old Suffolk man's behind bars after slamming into a van, or slamming a van, I should say, into a power pole. What he did to get the van has residents shaking their heads. Then on your side, Lori Crouch is here with more details on that story. Well, Tom, the van belonged to a 65-year-old man. He was walking to it when police say he got knocked to the ground. On Tuesday night, Suffolk police say Eltonis Outlaw lived up to his name. Just before 10 p.m., the 26-year-old jumped a 65-year-old man in the parking lot of this kangaroo store. The older man had just left the store and was walking to his van parked out of sight of the clerk when it happened. Police say Outlaw's punch knocked the man to the ground. He rifled through his pockets, stole his keys, and jumped in the van. Jessica Huxford lives around the corner. Cops just went up the road like normal. It's an everyday thing around here, so I didn't think anything of it. And Police spotted the van not far away and went after it, but Outlaw's speed and erratic driving forced them to back off. It wasn't far before police found the van in Chuckatuck slammed into this power pole. People who heard the crash did not want to go on camera, but say they saw the driver get out and run. Outlaw didn't get far, and neither did Lori Meredith, whose 20-minute commute home stretched into two hours. And there's just a line of cars, and all you see is blue lights everywhere. Mm -hmm. And then, like, four more cop cars showed up. The incident has both girls rethinking their trips to the corner store. We walk up there in the dark sometimes, so, like, if they're willing to do that to a 65-year-old man who's saying not going to do it to 200 and some pound girls. Now the 65 year old man hurt his legs, his arm and his back. He was treated at the hospital and released. Police charged outlaw with carjacking and eluding police. He'll be back in court on August 15th. Lori Crouch, 10 on your side. Court records show that outlaw has an extensive criminal history that includes drug possession and various driving infractions.